Good morning everyone, today we're going to be talking about PSO today. Now I know a lot of you guys are automatically thinking there's no content in the game, why do I even care about PSO today? Well in today's video I'm going to be telling you why you should take advantage of PSO today in order to up your game. But first of all, if you're new to the channel I upload videos daily, so if you like what you see I would really appreciate a subscribe as it really helps out the channel. Anyway, without further ado, let's begin the video. Alright, so the very first thing when you log in, we are going to go to our systems, go to get campaign items, and receive items on account. And right here, PSO today, 44 star gems right off the bat. Free, free, free. The next thing I want to talk about is don't forget about the item trader over here. A lot of people have been missing out every single week, but you talk to them, you go to item exchange over here, and the augmentation success rate plus 10%. You can get three of these every single week. As you can see here, limited edition items, there's three remaining, and you can only buy three every single week. So we are simply gonna buy them. And in order to get them, you will need these gold and prim swords so let's go to all storage and boom 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 and voila once you put in 10 you say yes and bam you have a n augmentation success rate plus 10 percent this is very very valuable because this is going to aid us in our augmentations so for example let's say that you want a gigas might 2 on your weapon or even on your armor you can see here it's only 80 percent if you put 10 capsules however we're getting the five percent server boost and then if you use a 10 percent booster that will be bumped up to 95 percent now of course if you want to play it super safe and you don't want to take any risks at all you can use the 15 percent booster to get a 100% success rate. Now in order to get a 15% booster, you are going to need to come to the item trader over here, go to item recycle, and right here, end augmentation success rate plus 15%. However, it will cost you 20 SG scratch items or 20 AC scratch items. Now if you've been doing the free SG scratch every single day, you should have at least 28. You might have one more or two more than me. I don't remember if I missed a day or not, but you should definitely be above 20 of these SG recycle badges, which will allow you to pick up one of those 15% augmentation aids, okay? So since it is PSO2 day, don't forget we get a 20% increased rare drop rate in New Genesis, so farming for these golden prim swords are not going to be very difficult. So if you do want to grind, today is definitely one of those days to grind in order to get all of these prim swords, get all of those 10% augmentation aids, so that you can guarantee all of those augments for your braver, regardless whether you're going katana or bow. The next thing I want to talk about are capsules, specifically Ale Domina, because Ale Domina gives you 5 HP, 3 PP, and potency plus 1.5%. Keep in mind that this potency will apply to melee, range, and technique, which is very, very powerful. Now in order to make Ale Domina, you're going to need Ale Notes A, B, C, D, 5 Photon Quartz, and 5 Trinite. So in order to get all of these, you will need to go around in the open world and kill a bunch of mobs. Now I don't know if the 20% boost in New Genesis actually affects the drop rate for capsules, but I'm going to assume that it does. If I am wrong, please let me know in the comment section below, and if I really am wrong, I'll pin your comment, and uh, I really hope I'm not wrong, because, you know, it kind of, it'd be really dumb if I was wrong. Another thing people can also farm for are the urgent quests, because that's where you get the next soul 2, as well as the Daedal soul 2. Now, of course, you can get the next soul by fighting the veteran dragon on the island as well. Um, I'm not entirely sure about the Daedal Soul. Can you get the Daedal Soul from killing the axe and the sword? I think you can. I'm not 100% sure on that. But basically, when the urgent quest comes up, just do it, all right? It's PSO today. You got that 20% extra drop rate. You you just want to do it, all right? If you get any of these and you are a premium member, you can make money just by selling it. And if you're a free-to-play player, you can use it to increase your own power because getting that extra 5 PP as well as 2% melee weapon potency is definitely super duper nice. Now that is not all, we also have base PSO2. So remember that campaign where we had to complete the story? Now a lot of you guys were like, oh my god Carol, forehead, you just need to get to level 100 and you can beat the crap out of Shiva, obviously. So during PSO2, base PSO2 actually gets a lot of boosts. First of all, we get more fun points plus 100%, EXP earn plus 200% guys, rare drop rate plus 200%, Gathering fever occurrences increased by 100%, and of course we've got the augmentation success rate plus 15%, enhancement EXP plus 15%, and item enhancement success rate plus 10%. Now keep in mind, 
This is only applied to base PSO2. In new Genesis, all we get is a 5% EXP increase as well as a rare drop rate plus 20%, okay? So please take advantage of this 200% EXP earned in order to boost your classes to 100 or at least your main class to 100 so that you can complete the story and blast through everything easy peasy. While we're on the topic of leveling, don't forget that we do get the 5% EXP boost in new genesis which will also help you a little bit in getting more nx cubes remember you're going to need all of these nx cubes in order to increase your weapons potential so for example you can see berserk unit level 4 over here as well as bastion unit level 4 in order to get it to level 4 you are going to need to use five of those nx cubes which require you to level up five times above level 20. so that is actually quite a bit of exp and will require a little bit of farming however i believe in you you guys can do it now last but not least let's rapid fire through the events and campaigns which are ending on august 4th the first one is very simple group chat campaign make sure you made a group chat and you've talked eight times in order to get 50 star gems screenshot submission campaign please make sure that you have taken a screenshot posted it on twitter that you're following the pso2 official twitter as well as uploaded your screenshot with hashtag pso2 ngs underscore ss campaign now this is really worth it because there's 800 star gems on the line and they're picking 20 winners and last but not least is the web link event over here. So this is where we're getting the augmentation success rate plus 5%. We need 22 million. We are at 18 million right now. So if you are planning to play a little bit, now would be a great time because it's a win-win situation. You benefit from farming right now by getting more gold prim swords, which you turn into your augmentation A 10%. And you're also farming for all of those capsules in order to make L Domina and leveling up your class in order to get more NX cubes. So it's a win-win-win and with the web event that's another win so four wins in a row so tldr today is a good day to play new genesis or pso2 in general if you want to go back to the base game and level up your classes to 100 so that you can complete the story remember the story quest clear campaign has been extended so you can see here it'll now end on september 1st so you have a lot more time so please take advantage of pso2 day today to get your class to 100 so that you can blast through the story a lot easier especially with that shiva fight at episode 6 so please don't sleep on this exp earn plus 200 because if you're doing the recommended four quests at the same time that is actually 600 more exp earned it is nuts it is insane you will level up extremely quickly so please take advantage of it it's free it's limited to today only so do it okay special thanks to all the members for supporting the channel it really means a lot to me thank you again but yeah, that's pretty much all I wanted to cover in today's video. Hopefully you guys found it helpful. If you did, I would appreciate a like and a subscribe. And I'll see you guys in tomorrow's video. Bye!